Okay. We are going to, because I realize apparently making suspension vehicles is difficult. I, I'm going to do how to make this little buggy that I made the other day. Where is that save? Takes a few times to load in because it uses a rotational suspension thing. So, will it work? Nope. <laughs> So they might not load in straight away, like the right way, because look, it, it can flip around and the pistons don't really care if it does. But once it's up the right way, yes. This is my little dune buggy and I am going to show you how to build this thing because it's drifty. As you can see from that, it's got slightly decent balance. Once we pop some custom wheels on it, it'll be better, which I will also show you how to do. I'm not gonna teach how to make them because that's a bit difficult and time consuming so we're just gonna start off with it from here I mean come on it's nice and um when I get to 150 subs I'll just put this onto the discord server which I will have in the description and the comments just because descriptions are hard to find just want to make sure that's the start of the video so nobody thought oh weird tutorial not doing that <laughs> so we're gonna start with the stick and put a stick that way. That way. Jeez. Just going from school. Give me a break. Uh, put a seat there. Let's see if I got that the right way around. I did not. That's what the seat's for. Let's see, did I get that right? Yes, I did. I am doing this all from memory, by the way, so if it's not quite the same, it might be better. Probably won't be. So the custom wheels I'll show you how to put on after we finish these ones. So we're gonna have spin up that that. So there we go. Might do another crappy fun now. <laughs> Cause that was funny. And ironic because it got surprisingly good views for how crap it was. You know what? I'm gonna use a gyro to stabilize this quickly. It's, I'm good at this. We're also gonna do the same at the front here. Yep, okay. Put a gyro there. Just so that we know which way around it's supposed to go. And put all the sticks on. That's gyros. Gyro. Ah! Gonna get that done. Buh, buh, buh. You wanna go up right? Go. It did it. By the way, is it just I've noticed that physics has been bugging in Road to Granby's a bit? If anybody knows anything about why that's happening, please inform me. Cause like I've noticed if I don't touch part of a build, like a suspension system, it just doesn't It doesn't need you to it doesn't ask you to do it. It doesn't try to do anything, it doesn't bother, you know? So, if anybody knows why that's been happening, if that's a Roblox thing or Road to Granby's once again being weird, just, just tell me, please. Because <laughs> I need to know if that'll be a serious issue soon. <sighs> Let's go. Okay, we only need I split a four for this. So we're gonna do that, that, and that, and now those are all on that. We'll set that to T. Just thinking ahead here. Oh. There we go. And that's gonna go there. Okay. So when you press T, it'll turn on the suspension and get it out of the whatever weird position it's in at that moment in time because suspension weird oh <laughs> almost made a mistake straight away you want to do the one diagonally opposite off of, off of each piston because that way that is the furthest point it'll push to and I'm just gonna say reasons. Uh, 
If you understand why, you understand why. If you don't, I don't know how I would explain it to you. And now we can. There we go. And see that settles out like that. One moment. Put some. Words. Nice. So, uh. That's the back wheel's done already. Just gonna put spinners there. We're gonna thrust her to make it go forward because. Gonna be honest, it's just a bit better that way. I know it's not as realistic, but it, it's just smoother. When you have custom wheels up, that is. Gonna get rid of that guy now that we don't need it. Cause, oh, right, we we might need it actually. Oh, never mind. Now we do. Now we don't. <laughs> so that suspension is gonna be holding that up for a while. The. 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 And the. No, the. It's gonna be the same. Yes, it sort of is. And those aren't going like that. We are going to surround everything except from the top with magazines to get rid of its attachment points when we do the wheels because that is just something you need to learn to do <laughs> trust me it's really helpful to do that oh wait never mind those ones those ones yeah uh i always make a mistake somewhere don't i <laughs> let's get that the that the stick Three of them. If you want to put a reverse in, that's fairly easy to do. I don't think I need to explain how to do that. If I do, I'm just gonna. No, I'm not. I'm, no, I don't need to tell you how to put it. <laughs> I'm not even gonna think about that. That is just painful. If you can't do um, a reverse, that is sad. It is just a backwards thruster. Also, I was gonna do a video on how to put a handbrake onto the custom car we did last video, but. Okay, that was that was my fault, mostly. Now we have some nice <laughs> no, not recolored sticks. Let's not do that. We don't need to do that. Let's keep it all the same shade, just so that it's a bit easier to know what's going on for all of you little human beings. You want to go up again? That's nice. Thank you. So yeah, I recommend turning off explosions if you're not um, too familiar with the way pistons work in this game. They explode. Turn off explosions. Don't let them explode. Is this, is this off now? Upright, once again. Oh no, no. Don't do that. Go that way. It's been 10 minutes already, has it? Give me a minute. Be right back. All right, that's back. Uh, definitely been done. Nope. <laughs> Let's just hope for the best. Pop that there. What? What did I do to you? I see you. Oh, it lost all its mags. Luckily it didn't lose its attachment points. Uh, yeah, if you didn't catch what happened a minute ago, yeah, it did explode. Because when you place a piston, when you place a piston on itself, it blows up. And I, th I don't think I need to explain what I did. I placed a piston on itself. Blow up. All right, there we go. Pop that there. That's about flip sideways. I said so. Woohoo! Oh, it didn't flip. At least the front didn't flip. Let me grab you. There we go. Uh, if we put one there already, we've got a loose one there already. Get that. Grab that. Pop it there. Make my life 
easier. <laughs> Gonna have to push that out again just for reasons. Sorry if this is a bit hard to keep up with. I don't really know what's going on either. <laughs> there we go. And now these are both crossing over. We're going to get two joints and two ball sockets. Going to put a joint back here as well. Joint back here. Ball socket, ball socket. Just so the wheels will be level with one another. And get a piston. Get that joint. Come on. Pop that on there. Pop that on there. Got that like that. That works. Now to do the steering quickly. Get that there. That there. Gonna rotate. Y on each of them. Oh, all right, then we're just gonna do that, are we? Nice and easy. Put this like this. This like this. Same with the other one, just one connector. And one on the outside. And spin that all around. Pop this on here, this on here. Oh, they're both purple. Would you look at that? Wonder how unlikely that is. Put this to nine. Turn on rest and limit enabled. Same with her. Put this to nine. Turn on rest and limit enabled. We are going to, does the W actually do anything yet? And C, is this going to be A or D? I'm going to test D. That's D. All right then, put D on the right one, A on the left. Does this work on its own like this? No way. Oh, <laughs> drift buggy. Sorry, that was, that was too silly. I'm going to put four wheels on. And that is your June buggy. Of course, right now, it's not going to be the most stable. And it's got too much torque. Don't want to go too fast. So get one bowling ball, two bowling balls. Then one more here and another one here. And you have yourself a June buggy. Hope this was useful for somebody and it, there we go now to show you what to do for custom wheels firstly you're going to want to do that because custom wheels are a bit heavy just a bit of an important thing to point out there they do weigh quite a bit so i'm going to get two thrusters on now how long have i been recording 13 minutes all right then i've got to hurry up with myself up. Where is the custom wheel? Ah, I've got a lot. That's the medium wheels. There we go. These wheels here, I will send the code in the comments and the description once again. And remember, at 50 subs, I'll put the... I mean, 150. <laughs> I will put the code to the buggy in the server for anybody that is too lazy to do it on their own. And that is not an insult. I would completely understand that. This is here to learn. If you're not bothered to learn, you can, you know, just always get the code. All right, let's get that flipped with face. Pop that on there. And now we have our own cust fully custom doom buggy. <laughs> This is not the best at uh, hitting things and getting over them. It is good at lumpy terrain and, you know, having a single wheel getting over something. If you try to bounce off the curb, you're just going to go flying, naturally. But there it is, your own June buggy. Remember, this version will not drift. The other one does because custom wheels don't drift. Well, at least not in my experience. Don't know how France do it. 
he cheated. <laughs> he cheated the system. And that is that. So yeah, I'm gonna save that, get that done, and farewell. <laughs>